Hello, welcome to Maths Digital. My name is Aaron, and today I want to explain you the difference between JBC functions and JBC statements. We have this phone number which has digits and dot as separator for digits. This one way we can represent phone number with the delimiter. And then it prints the word before and the value of the phone number. Okay. Now assume the business wants to change this delimiter dot to hyphen. How can you achieve that? Basically in InfoBasic or JBC, we have two functions and two statements which can do the task for us. We can either use convert as a function or statement or change as a statement and function. Let's use change. Okay? When we use change function, it will return a new value. So each time you make a call to change function, you give it the variable or the value you want to change, what you want to change, want to replace with what. So it's like find all the dots in this phone number and replace them with hyphen. This is what it will do. But this will return a new value which we can store in another variable, for instance, phone one, in case we want to keep the original variable. If we print the original phone number and the new phone number, we're going to see that the original phone number did not change. So this function did not change. It does not mutate the original value. It returns a new value. Let's see that. All right, so as you can see, after applying this function change, we still have our phone variable. It still has the old value with the dots. And the new variable has hyphen as we wish. Okay? And maybe this is what you need. You don't want to change the original value. You want to return a new value and use it. Now, what if we use change as statement? Now, I'm going to paste the source code for... Now, this is how to use the statement. Change statement. It's very simple. So, you write change you want to change what? You want to change dot to what? To hyphen in this variable. So here I need to be careful because after calling this statement, this phone number will now have a new value. So it's going to be changed. And going forward, we won't have this phone number with a dot. So let's save to compile and run. Okay, so now as you can see, after making a call to this statement, the phone variable has a new value. Now going forward, if you want to use the phone number, we know that it has hyphen. So depending on what you want to achieve, if you want to change the original of value and you don't want to maintain the original value so you can use a statement it's faster you just do that like this change what to what in your variable and it will automatically change the variable but if you want to keep the original variable it's better to use the function because the function does not mutate the value the original value okay 
I hope now you understand the difference between a function and statement in, in InfoBasic. Thank you for watching this video. If you haven't subscribed, please subscribe. See you next. Bye-bye.